Hi everyone, I'm Dr. M, and I'm gonna show you how to get the red rupee in Sora's River. There are three methods I know of for getting the red rupee, and I'm gonna show you two of them. Now the first method is one I used to use, but I would not recommend it though. You go down the waterfall as normal, but when you get to this waterfall right here, you're gonna want to face the left wall and target it. And then just hold back on your control stick like this. I'm now holding back on my control stick. Now when you got this, you're gonna start mashing B and keep mashing B when you go over the next waterfall and Link will do a jump slash. It looks like this. When you see Link getting the jump slash, you're gonna hold left on your controller and you're gonna keep holding left until you get the red rupee. So don't let go until you get the rupee. Like that. And you're gonna get the red rupee. Now the second method I'm going to show you is a little bit more complex than the first one, but this is the one most people use and this is the one I recommend you use, even though it's a little bit more complicated. It's actually easier to get the red ruby this way since you get a larger window to get the sword slash recoil off the wall to get the ruby. Uh, so this is what you do. You go down the waterfalls as normal here. But when you get to this waterfall, instead of facing the left wall as we did with the first method, you're gonna want to face straight ahead towards the next waterfall. And you want to be right up next to the right wall. Okay, and a very important part of this is you want to Z target as soon as you fall off this waterfall right here and keep holding Z target. Doing this prevents the Octorok from hitting you. So if you don't hold Z target, chances are the Octorok is going to pop up and hit you and mess you up. So remember to do that and remember to do it even before you hit the water after falling down this waterfall here. If you push C target too late, the Octorok might still fuck you up. So it, it looks like this. Okay, so I'm, I'm facing straight ahead now and I'm right up next, next to the right wall and I'm holding Z target. You're gonna want to hold Z target for a little while and then release it so you can turn to the left, like straight left and do a dive like this. Okay, so now I'm diving. Now you want to keep holding left for the rest of the trick until you get the red rupee. Do not let go of left of your control stick to the left until you get the red rupee. So now when when Link starts to dive, all you need to do is just mash B and hold left on the control stick like this. And you get the red rupee. So, hopefully this was helpful to you. If you have any questions about this, please let me know. Thank you for watching guys and good luck with getting the red rupee.